Okay, Martin. Um, so in the last week or so, a few younger players have made the move out of Brisbane Road. Uh, do you want to explain what the thinking was behind those decisions? Yeah, the thinking is really, it, it, it's twofold. Uh, one is the, uh, to help them yeah, in terms of that, you know, if, if you're letting players go in the summer, there's an awful lot of players that are going at the same time and released at the same time. So if we feel they've got no future uh, with us going into next season, uh, we think the best course of action is to is to release them and and allow them to try and find pastures new. Uh, and the other side of it is that it, it's, it allows us to concentrate on the people that are left, you know, and looking to uh, hone what we're looking to, to take into next season. So um, Aaron Pollock and uh, Freddie Moncur have been the two that have left recently. Aaron Pollock's then gone and signed for Leatherhead on the permanent and Freddie Moncur has gone to Wingate and Finchley. That sort of backs up your point that this is a good opportunity for them to go find clubs before most of the other players get released. Yeah, when I've talked to the, you know, or any of the youngsters I've talked to, I just said you need to go out there and be playing between now and the end of the season. Uh, whatever level that that is, if you want to get back into the national league, or you want, or you feel that you can play higher, there's nothing better than uh, for, for for scouts at this moment of time to go and watch you playing in a first team at you know Leverett or Wingate and Finchley or wherever where it may be. But uh, you know they, these are boys that have played for the club. They've been around the club for a long time and uh, probably got fast tracked a little bit in terms of uh, the amount of games they played. You know, last season because of the lack of uh, senior players towards the end, and uh, it's just, you know, it, it, it's about a, re a reality check, uh, and, and for them to to bounce back. You know, there's there, if you get released from a football club, you won't be the first person that's ever bounced back, and we want to try and make it as uh, obtainable for them as we possibly can. And this was a decision made by yourself in in, con in conjunction with the uh, the footballing staff as well. Yeah, I mean, it, Justin uh, it, wouldn't be making the main decisions. You know, he 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 decides who he feels that can move on uh, and 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 uh, no longer uh, of use to him in, within the squad. But obviously, that's ratified by me. You know, if 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 it's always an open conversation uh, between myself, Justin and, and the football staff but uh, you know there's been no difference of opinion in any way shape or form at the moment the decisions that's been made uh, we're very comfortable with there may be some other um, some other them decisions coming in 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 the future we you know we had an awfully big squad you know over 32 we had 32 players at one stage within the squad uh, so it's thinned it down by two at the moment but the bigger picture is we're looking for the 18-19 season and what we want uh, from the squad that we've got moving forward. And uh, the performances of Dan Happy and Josh Cromer this season sort of show that there is a route to the first team for young players as well at the club. Yeah, I mean, it, it's, it's, you know, as I said, when I come in here, uh, in, uh, you know, what was it now, 10 months ago? nine months ago there was an awful lot of young players that had contracts at this football club but the proof is that the people that we feel that's got talent will be given a chance and, and the two names you, you've just brought up there Dan Appy and, and Josh Cromer uh, have been fixtures or certainly Dan Appy has been a, a fixture in the side uh, for most of the season Josh Cromer has certainly been a fixture uh, recently and, and, and both have come to the fore and, and it, there's, no, there's no hesitation for Justin or myself that, that, that the young players will be incorporated, but they need to be the young players that we feel that will come into a squad that can take us forward.